How are you all? I'm just uploading a video just now. We've got nine minutes remaining. But I thought I would come on. After it would, let me see if I can get the chat up while that's uploading. Hmm. Do you know what? I've not got the sound down or anything. <laughs> I've been busy, busy, busy all week with the, the grandson. All week, so. Today I'm catching up on some housework. And uh, I'm doing a live stream with you. I want to hear about the solar eclipse. I've seen pictures of it. I've seen pictures of it and it looked amazing. Uh, there was one lady that I, I watch and she stays in Texas and she was outside when it was like the total um, eclipse. Oh, I hate it when it's squinty like that. Okay, we'll just need to do. Right, let me get the chat up. There, I found this. That's us now. There we go. There. So good morning, good morning. I know I've not been on for a while, but as I say, I've been busy, busy. So to make up for it, I've done a video that's going to be up in seven minutes or less. We'll see how it goes. Um, and it's a makeup one, but it's a different kind of makeup one. It's a pretend makeup one. Wait a minute, I can't stand this when it's squinty like that. There, that's better. <laughs> that is better now. So what else has been happening in my life? Not a lot. Not a lot. My poor mother, my mum, she's really no well to know. She's get really bad pains in her back and all the way down her back. And apparently it's see the virus. Right, it's a it's a um something to do with that. It's like a side effect for having that. And um she's just really, really sore. But she's been taking just paracetamol, but I think she might need that something a bit stronger. So my dad's phoning up today to see if we can get something a bit a bit stronger for her. Um, to help her, because she's in a lot of pain. She's really she's been in pain for weeks. Well, a, a week. <laughs> it seems like weeks, but it's been a week that she's been really no well. So and I was on flashy duty. I know I've not put pictures up, but I was doing flashy. My brother was away to Whitby, it's called. And he likes to go down there to hunt for fossils. So I've got Daisy do here as well. I'll show you in a minute. Um, so my brother and my sister-in-law, they were away down there for Monday. So I was doing flashy, the wee cat. I was doing it. I was going up at half past five. Listen, this is what it's been like this week. Half past five, I've been leave. I've been going up and sitting with the cat for half an hour and then I've been going like to get the wee fella's food because he, he loves watermelon so I get him watermelon every day when he's when he's here so then I went to the shop at six o'clock in the morning and then after that I went and I collected my, my grandson and bring him down here and looked after him so it's been it's been a really really busy week for me but it's flew in the more it's Saturday again but I've got a wee tiny, tiny baby here. Want to see the wee baby? Look at this wee tiny, tiny baby right here. Oh, Heather and Marcel gave me... I'll need to show you my... my um, I'll need to show you my animal crossing. Heather and Marcel gave me fruit. So now I've got apple trees and I've got orange trees. There I am today. Look, I thought I would put on bunny ears today. <laughs> so I've got um, lots of trees and they gave me bells, like, which is the money for this. And uh, I don't know what to, to, how to spend it, though, because you can only buy five items a day. And I can't buy everything. I would love to buy everything, but just because I've started, there's no that much I can buy. So... And they've been making money trees. Trees with money on them. I'll show you what I got this morning, which is pretty cool. A nice wee waterfall thing. And see when it's on the hour. Oh, it'll happen soon. Oh, no, it won't. It's past. Um, 
when it's on the hour, these wee, the seal squirts out um, water and there's wee fish there that squirt out water as well. It's really cool, I didn't know that happened. It was just a, a, by accident I found that out. So, yeah, I've got apples. I don't know what other things I've not got. I've got apples, I've got oranges, I've got cherries, I've got pear, I've got coconut. Is that all the trees you get? I'm not sure. And I made black roses for the first time. I've got one black rose. And I know that if you plant them um, next to each other, you end up with golden roses. And that's what I want. I want golden roses. <laughs> so, so I've been been doing that in my spare time. My spare time, I've been, I've been doing my animal crossing. That's what I'm doing. I've got, hold on a minute. I've got painkillers here because my back is broke. My back is so sore. Wait till I'm doing this. It's just paracetamol. But my back is done in completely. <laughs> so I've got my pink glasses on to match my hair to do my pink glasses on I've, I'm, I'm trying to get through the. you'll hear my washing machine and tumble dryer going it's been gone since yesterday the amount I don't know how I end up with such amount of washing and iron but I've, I've got my new ironing board I've not used it yet I might use it on Sunday I might do an iron on Sunday and use my new ironing board because I'm trying my hardest to get all that washing done it's driving me nuts and see, once you get it done, and like, for instance, last night, after I dropped the wee fella off and I, I went up and I done, my brother's cat came back down here and started to tidy up the place. So I was tidying up, tidying up. And I done all my dishes. My dishes were all done and dried and put away. And I went and I was cleaning my bathroom. And I goes back into my kitchen this morning. Guess what? My dishes that Peter's just dumped in there. Just dumped the dishes. He didn't do them. He just put them in there after me. Now that I don't know about you, but that triggers me. <laughs> so far, I nearly swore. I mean, it was like a a, a plate, a small plate, and a couple of cups. And I was like, for God, oh, well, what is the point? What is the point? And I don't know many times. This is the, I'm then I'm starting to moan, but I don't know many times I've seen them see things that are finished like milk or, or even the the, the pods the, the soap powder pods and stuff like that see when it's finished and it's an empty box put it in the bin but no every time i go into my my, my wee cupboard to get out my, my soap powder and stuff like that there's empty boxes drives me insane i can't be the only one that, that's triggered with that but i <laughs> So, so I done the dishes for him, but I was swearing the whole time that I was doing the dishes. There was, there was bad words coming out my mouth. Right, let's see if this video's done so I can I can hit publish. Yes, it's done. Right, let me just make this this video live. Publish. There we go. Right, let me just share it to my Facebook and my Twitter. I'll still do a makeup uh, video tomorrow. This was just a wee, uh, this was just a, a wee video that I thought I would do this morning because I've not seen these for a while. And my lovely Vera, she was, she was, she sent me a message. She was worried about me. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Right, let me go into the Twitter or X. Oh, I was watching a court... I'll talk about it in a minute. I was watching a court case. Wait a minute till I publish this. See, my, my tumble dryer's making this terrible noise all the time, but what can you do? I just need to let it. Oh, it's my ex anniversary. Celebrate it with a special post created just for you. No, oh, you're all right, ex. I'm all right. Anyway, right, let's close that. 
There we go, that's it up. I actually, I actually done three videos today. Two of them were custom videos, so I've been busy. Wait a minute here. There we go. There. No, it's not up. Why is it not up? Mmm. There it is. Got it. There. That's that done. There. But I want to know all about the solar eclipse. I wish somebody was in to tell me all about it. As I say, this lady that I watched that stays in Texas, she was out in her street and it was like, do you know what? It didn't go pitch black. It is good morning, good morning. A crazy storm like yesterday. Oh my God, you need to tell me about that. Um, our place was flooding. I was sitting here the other night and all I had was drip, drip of water coming through my kitchen again and still there's nobody come out to fix it. Um, yeah, but this, this lady had, um, Mel, good afternoon or good morning to you. It's, it's 11, 18 minutes past 11, so it's still morning. Good morning, good morning. Um, I, she was out in the street, but see, when it was totality, the, the, the solar eclipse, I thought it went, like, pitch black, but it, it didn't really. It went kind of, or I don't know if it was just because it was her, that she, it was, she was, she had her camera. But it looked like, you know how it dusk, when it's dusk? That's the kind of, the way it looked. But I want to know if it went darker than that, or if, if it was just like our camera, maybe our cam. You know how sometimes cameras in the dark make things kind of light? Um, but it still looked awesome and, and spooky, because it was like at lunchtime. It was like, it was like at lunchtime as well. Uh, but there was still birds chirping. There was it should still still some birds were chirping about, uh, but I amazing amazed. I don't I don't think I'll ever see one, because the next time in Scotland I think it's something like I think it's something like two, uh, two thousand and ninety or something. <laughs> Wait a minute to check. Wait a tell you how long, you know. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. Two thousand and ninety. <laughs> I think I'm going to be long gone by then. The next solar total, total solar eclipse to hit the UK, two thousand and ninety. <laughs> That'll be good. <laughs> Did you mail? Yeah, see, I've seen a partial eclipse. I think it was nineteen ninety nine or something here, and. Um, we down in England, somewhere in England, they they got the the total eclipse, but we got like a it was some like a seventy percent or something. Oh, your cat says hi, Thesis. I was watching my brother's cat all week. I've been going up and doing my brother's cat all week. Uh, oh, I was going to look at my phone for pictures, but I'm on my phone here. I'm like, I'm crazy. Um, yeah. So when it happened here, the eclipse, we had like a wee set up. There was like a bit of paper and I can't remember what, but you could, you looked at the bit of paper and you could actually see the, the eclipse on it. We had the glasses as well, mind you. And it, it looked as if the, the moon was just taking a chunk out the, the sun, you know, it was like a bite was taken out. Of it. That's, that's what um, ours was like, but it's still amazing. Oh, that tumble dryer's annoying me listening to it. I just need to let it do its thing, but it is triggering. <laughs> and it's going to have to be on all bloody day, so I'll just... I've got a feeling it's, it's going to go in the blink. Do you know that? I've got a feeling the tumble dryer is going... See if it does, I'm just going to need to get a clothes horse to hang my clothes up because I, I'm a broke bitch. You know what I mean? So it'll be just a clothes horse in the kitchen. <laughs> the tumble dryer will be for just decoration. I don't know many tumble dryers I've had in my lifetime. But we're talking maybe 15 or something like that, and that's a lot. I go through tumble dryers like nothing on earth. Here it is, it's, it's really triggering. I should just close the door.
But yeah, th is that is it like a magic what oh, the police come into the street? Oh, hello there, boys. Hmm. Wonder what's happening up the road. Eh. Uh, yeah, the, that was nice. I wonder if it was Officer Bob. See if it was Officer Bob, your beauty, because I've got my makeup on today. <laughs> See if it's Officer Bob coming down to the bungalow. I mean, I told him he was he was more than welcome to come down here <laughs> and check on me. <laughs> more than Officer Bob locked the door behind him. Yeah, so I was what now a lot of people might not like me after this, right? But everybody's got an opinion. I was watching the trial of um Mew, the guy's name was Nikolai Mew or something, right? But he was on a river and there was a bunch of guys, teenagers, a bunch of teenagers, 17 year olds, you know, and they were drinking. And I know they shouldn't be drinking and all that, but listen, that's what some, sometimes young, young, young games do. So they were on the river, and I don't know what the hell happened, but something happened and they ended up now like calling the guy names and stuff like that and really been it was horrible to watch because they were calling the guy a lot of names and they you could see the, the the guy was upset with us but he wasn't walking away he was confronting this big group of boys right and he went this girl came over to him and said to him go away go away go away and he's either punched her or slapped it no it's on video as well punched her or slapped her in the face right Melissa, thank you so much, lovely Melissa. You're too kind. Um, so the guy had a, a weapon on him and pulled it out and started to go to town on these uh, young kids, or young adults, I should say. Uh, one of them, he actually unalived. One of them was very, very close to it. His heart had stopped like for nine minutes or something on the way to the hospital. Um you know, he, he went he went to town. So, in the chat, it was Lon Kring channel that I watched. In the chat, a lot of people were saying it was self-defence because they, they were, there was a, a group of them and they were all shouting at them. But they didn't have weapons or anything like that. You know, they, they never had weapons on them. And he was not walking aware. See, if it was me, I'd have went, oh, can, can, just control yourself, lads, with the booze or whatever, and walked away, do you know what I mean? It's, it's like a, a group of teenagers, that's, that's what you do. But he, he went to town and uh, it, was, it was terrible. <laughs> they just, I'd love to see that. <laughs> I'd love to see that. Um, so a lot of people were saying it was self-defence, but I, do, I don't, it wasn't self-defence. I don't think it was self-defence. I don't think the guy intended to go over and do that. But in the moment, he just went crazy and just just started to swing this, this uh, weapon around. So a lot of people in the chat were saying not guilty. And I was saying, no, he's, he's guilty. Maybe not of first, de first degree intentional, but he's definitely guilty of, uh, you know, the unaliving and, and attempted unalive. And stuff like that. So, it was like a it was like a fifty fifty in the chat in long crime. And then the verdict came in yesterday, and the jury were I think the jury were right. Uh, they convicted him of um, reckless homicide or something like that. It's called. It's no like uh, first degree intentional. It's a lesser one, but still it's a badging, and he got guilty for for all because it was like six kids or something that he'd done this day and um, and people were shouting they're not kids they're adults see a 17 year old to me they're still a kid they're a young adult but they're still they're still their their brain is not developed they, they they do things like groups of teenagers when they're together that's the kind of stuff they do especially here as well they'll shout you you you're fat beep and you know they, they especially if one kicks off somebody else but the adult thing to do is just to go like that. Just control yourself, lads, and just walk away. Walk away. Oh, there's a police way back out. Ah, oh, well, maybe Officer Bob the next time. <laughs> so people were falling out in the chat. People were all falling out. 
I don't think I've no. I watch all the and I'm watching the D Bell trial as well. They're now the the um, Lori Vallow's man. So people were all falling out in the chat. I've never seen anything like it. <laughs> no, there's a, there's a reason that there's like twelve people. There's a jury because some people have got different opinions and and. I respect her. See if somebody says, I think he's not guilty. I, I respect you that you, you think that and it's your choice, but this is my choice. Do you know what I mean? Catherine, hello, my gorgeous Catherine. How are you? So folk were all going nuts. <laughs> they were all calling each other names. Never, I've, never, I've never seen anything like it. I was like, wow. Because a lot in crime used to have a lot of moderators, right? One was called Addy. And she was a moderator for years and years and years. Yes, Mel, they do. Teenagers do that. It's been, here as well. See if they're in a group, they'll, they'll shout stuff at you. And the best thing to do is just don't engage. You don't engage. You just walk away. Just just walk away. That's what you do. Because you're not, you're not going to win. It's, it's a group of teenagers. But he had a weapon on him and started going... No, he's need to look it up. Because it was yesterday you get found guilty. Jenny, Jenny, how is the weather up there? Oh, see down down this area. Oh, we're all talking about your area. Not actually your area, but the, the area you stay in. Sophie, hello, hello, hello. Because of the... There's meant to be a Rangers match. <laughs> there is meant to be a Rangers match against where you stay, right? And they couldn't do it the first time because of the waterlogged pitch. <laughs> and then again, it was Wednesday or something, they were meant to play in your area as well. And it got postponed because they had a waterlogged pitch. Well, I listened to the football phone in some nights, right, on Radio Clyde. And uh, they, were all, they were all kicking off, Jenny. They were all kicking off, saying, what a bloody disgrace. Waterlogged pitch and... They should have faked her. Oh, they were going, going, there's men and women going crazy here just because of this waterlogged pitch, Jenny. <laughs> it's like, don't worry, they'll play. Don't you, there's no rush. There's a rush. People take football way too serious here, though. Way too serious. It's not that windy here. We're, we're not too bad with the wind, the new... But the other night, the wind was terrible and up at my brother's, somebody's fence is down. I noticed that. Aye, Jenny, so they're all going mental down here. <laughs> about the pitch. <laughs> they're all going crazy about the bloody pitch. Listen, I don't pl it's, like, it's like, what's the rush? What is the rush? But they, are, they, they go crazy. And there was a football match here as well, Jenny, last Sunday. Celtic and Rangers played. What a match that was. No, it was it was it was three all, right? It was three all. But what a ma I thoroughly enjoyed that match. Do you know why? I, I preferred my team to win, but I was in the edge of my seat the whole time. It was like it, you just didn't know what was going to happen in that football match. I love that. I love football matches like that. The rain, Jenny, as I'm saying, I was sitting here the other night and got the, listen, the grass cutters are out, gone crazy out there in front, you hear them? I wish they would do my grass. Listen to the racket in my house. <laughs> no, this is the reason I can't do ASMR videos at this time during the day, listen to it. Jenny, I know they're, they're all going crazy here. People are going mad here. Do you want to see my wee baba? Just see my baby. You seen hello to everybody, Daisy Dudu? You seen hello to everybody, my darling? Hmm? She's wondering about the grass cutters. You'll get used to it, baby. You'll get used to it. There. Wee Daisy Doo Doo. She's such a good girl. She's such a good girl. Yeah, wee Daisy Doo Doo. She's worried because of the grass cutters, but she'll get used to it when she needs to get used to 
Do you know, Jenny, the other day as well, she wasn't the one to go out for her W-A-L-K because it was windy. <laughs> she was, her, her tail was between her legs. It was a wee shame. Can I drag her? Drag her with the, the, the thing. I nearly said the word that you put round her neck to take them O-U-T. She knows some words now, so she does. She knows some words. <laughs> So tomorrow is my flavouring day. I'm looking forward to it. How old is she? So let's say uh, July. Nine months. She's nine months. She's nine months now. Look at her. A big girl. She's she's still frightened of stuff though. It's a wee shame. Is a bloody racket. <laughs> Can you believe us? Because they're right at the side of my house. She's frightened. Look at her wee face. Eh? She's frightened. You're okay, baby. Do you know what that means? That means there's going to be grass over my my wall and everything like that. Aye, they're right at the side of my house. Why should we take it? Just run out of my front garden. Mind I used to get them today. That it was something like uh, twenty-five quid or something like that a month or 12 quid a month or something like that. And they used to, they, they wrecked a few of my bushes. I had a, a, I had a buddler that got run over with a lawnmower. I had um, a rhododendron that got murdered as well with their bloody lawnmowers. So, and a few, a few decorations get killed as well. Oh, my wee baby. Shame. Shame for her. I wish they would just hurry up and do that, but he is coming again dead loud. I just want to cuddle her while it happens. Yeah. God, this should be done now. Please go. He's coming back up for F's sake. How long does it take? Yeah. She needs to get used to it. I don't want her frightened of the fireworks either. Not how Poppy was terrified of fireworks. So I'm thinking if she gets used to loud noises that she'll not be too bothered with the fireworks. But with wee Poppy, that was that was horrible. It, and it was like the October all the way through to January, people would be letting off fireworks, you know, they, they can't, they can't wait for firework night to let off fireworks, they just, they buy fireworks up there and then they, they can't wait to get home and let them off in the car park there. The whole house goes boom. So hopefully she's okay with them and I can actually enjoy firework night and look out at the fireworks and stuff. I used to love watching the fireworks, but until wee Poppy was uh, terrified. Hey, you're okay, darling. I think that's the guy gone now. I think he's gone. No, he's not. Is he? No, Catherine, they just anybody can buy a fire as long as you're 18. Over 18 and over, you can buy fireworks. Aye. And they're on sale for like October, all the way through uh, January. And people let them off. It's, it's usually meant to only be like the 5th of November. Guy Fox. And I don't mind that. And with Poppy, even with Poppy, I, I didn't mind that. Like, and Guy Fox night. 
and then at New Year, people let off fireworks. I didn't mind that either. But it's like, even, they buy them and let them off during the day. Daytime and they're letting off the fireworks. It's crazy. And then one year, we've, we've got a, a dog poo bin, a metal dog poo bin over the road there, just over, over the road. They were putting fireworks in the dog poo bin. Boom! And it was like, it was like an explosion. It was craziness. And you dare not see this is it. This is where this guy went wrong uh, with the the kids on the river. You dare not say anything because see if you did, you'd be getting a firework through your letterbox or dog dog poo through your letterbox. One of the two. Yeah, they just they, and they just let them off. They just let them off all the time. It's 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 terrible. As I say, I don't mind Guy Fox and New Year, but it's like. It's like uh, when they, they let them off all the time. So hopefully D Daisy's going to be okay. Sophie, my big Dalmatian didn't care. And Mr. Mikey wasn't even that bothered either with, with fireworks. But Poppy was absolutely, like, terrified. Like, panting and shaking and squeezing in behind the couch and all that. It was a, a horrible thing. And even cuddling her and stuff like that, she wasn't content... I tried to make a wee bed in my wardrobe and put a wee cover down it and I was trying to get her in there for a, like a safe space to go in. But she wouldn't go in there either. It was, it was horrible. I kept thinking she was going to take a heart attack. It was that bad. Um, and then I think about all the wee other wee animals, wee foxes and stuff. Apparently there's a fox going about here and now. I've not seen it. But Peter seen it the other night. He says it was hanging about with a group of cats, but I'm thinking it's probably it's cubs. And Peter's just thought it's been cats. I hope she does get used to them. I really hope she does get used to the fireworks. That'd be great if she got used to them. So I'm trying to, like, no loud noises and stuff like that. I'm trying to get her used to it. As I say, she's, she was scared of the wind the other night, poor wee thing. Right, guys, I'm going to go and I'm going to make myself something for lunch. But I'll be back tomorrow. Tomorrow's my flavouring day, so I'll be back tomorrow. I've got a video up today and I'm going to have a video up for you tomorrow as well. Let's do it. I'm going to, I don't know what palette to use on these. I think I'll use, I don't know, one of my novelty palettes, like my cheeseburger palette or something like that. I think I'll use something like that tomorrow. So I love you all so much and I hope you have the most wonderful, wonderful day. And I will see you all tomorrow and I'm going to give you all a big kiss, you know. Bye, everyone.